Hello! Welcome to Storyline Online, brought to you by St. Agnes School. Today, for my Friday social-emotional activity, I am going to read Glad Monster, Sad Monster, a book about feelings, by Ed Emberly and Anne Miranda. The, ooh, I have to open it all the way up, sorry. The yellow monster says, opening birthday presents, playing ball, slurping ice cream, and dancing with my friend make me glad. Try on the yellow monster mask. What makes you glad? Let's see. Now I'm the glad monster. I see my nose under here. <laughs> Hmm, let's see, things that make me glad are kindergarten always makes me very glad. Um, ice cream makes me glad too. Snuggles from my mommy make me glad. And, hmm, good friends make me glad. What makes you glad? The blue monster says, waving goodbye. What? Watching my snow monster melt, losing my big blue balloon, and having it rain on parade day makes me sad. Pretend to be a sad blue monster. Have you ever been sad too? You know, I think we've all been sad before, and that's totally an okay feeling to feel. You know, you can be sad when a friend moves or when something doesn't go your way, but know that sadness won't last forever. There's always some other emotion on the other end. Hopefully happiness. The pink monster says, making valentines, rocking baby monster, baking muffins with Grammy monster, and hugging wiggly puppies make me feel loving. Put on the pink monster mask and tell what makes you feel loving. I'm going to be the pink monster. Something that makes me feel loving is going home to my cat, Fred, every day. I do love her so much. And spreading cheer, making cards, and making thank you cards for people make me feel loving. What about you? Rumble, rumble, crash, boom! The orange monster says, listening to a terrible thunderstorm, imagining what's hiding under my bed, seeing little creepy crawly things, growl, gruff, and being chased by grumpy growly things worry me. Can you act like the orange monster? What worries you? Uh, let's see, things that worry me a lot like the orange monster seeing creepy crawly things worries me. I know the creepy crawly things are probably more afraid of me than I am of them. But I still get a little freaked out. And watching scary movies makes me feel scared. The purple monster says being upside down. Making funny faces. La 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 la. Wearing big monsters clothes. And goinking around make me feel silly. Goink, goink, goink. Pretend to be a purple monster. How silly can you be? Ooh. You all know Miss O'Brien is silly, and I think it's funny that the purple monster, which is my favorite color, is the silly monster, because this was definitely my favorite monster. I like to be silly by talking in funny voices, by joking around with my kindergarten friends, and many other things. The red monster says, being bugged by a bug, getting splashed, being laughed at when I fall down, tee -hee 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 -hee. and having someone knock over my blocks makes me angry. Put on the angry red monster mask and say, what makes you angry? Whoa, he looks really angry, doesn't he? Things that make me angry are when my alarm clock doesn't go off in the morning or when I get splashed. I do not like getting splashed either. Ugh, what about you? <clears throat> Grr. The green monster says, growing my 
says growing. Sorry, one more time. Growling, showing my sharp white teeth, waving my hands in the air and saying, shoo, shoo. And boo, boo makes me very scary. Put on the green monster mask. Can you scare me? Can I scare you? Boo! Ah! Try and scare me. Oh my goodness. And that's the end. So this story is really just all about emotions and how we feel. We don't always feel happy and that is okay. But whenever we feel an emotion, we know we're not going to feel it forever. So if you are sad, it's okay to be sad or mad or excited or scared because we're just processing how we feel. And it's very important to always check in on how you feel. All right. I hope you enjoyed the story. And then um, if you are doing part of my craft afterwards, you can watch Miss O'Daniel's um, monster craft demonstration on how to do your craft for this book. All right, friends, great job, and always remember, keep learning and keep reading. Bye.